my experience as a scribe, I worked both in the ER as well as um, outpatient at a cardiology electrophysiologist's office. I worked for about four and a half years and over 4,000 hours as a scribe. Um, looking back on it now, not only did I document, but I would always anticipate the needs of the physician. I would follow up on labs for them. I would make sure certain labs were normal in order for them to order certain studies. Um, I would also alert them if there were any critical labs. I don't think that I was only someone that was documenting. I think I was a real assistant to the physician. I really was able to aid in um, their practice and in, um, in caring for a patient. And I think that initially when I started as a scribe, I was just a very introverted, quiet person and it was hard for me to kind of build relationships and really speak up for myself and build that relationship with the physician and the nurses. And with time and working as a scribe, I was able to learn how to be more of an extrovert and learn how to kind of articulate myself. I'm currently in PA school and I think that being a scribe has uh, given me the knowledge and the experience to really excel in the PA program as well as to becoming ultimately a PA in the professional world. A funny thing is I actually spoke with one of my professors the other day and she was like, you're miles ahead of where you should be at this point and I attribute all of that to being a scribe prior to this. I would recommend being a scribe to anyone. I think anyone who wants to go into healthcare, become a physician, become a physician assistant, nurse practitioner, or nurse, I think that this is the most beneficial job that you can ever have if you ever want to go into these fields. Because not only are you getting this direct uh, kind of patient care experience, you're kind of learning uh, how to kind of think like a physician or think like a healthcare provider. You're in the room with them while they're doing the physical exams. You're learning what the different treatment modalities are and you know how to interpret labs and how to interpret certain radiology findings. So I would recommend this and I do recommend it. <laughs>